Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time tuning in, my name is Angel Marino, but you can call me Mac Daddy. In today's video, I'm so excited. I'm gonna be sharing with you guys my brand new summer collection, Caliente. A lot of you guys have seen it on my Instagram page, but I'm so excited to walk you guys through this entire collection, share the inspiration with you guys, and do some swatches for you. So if you guys wanna know more about my summer Caliente collection, then keep on watching. This collection is honestly is so special to me. I really wanted to take the opportunity to really celebrate my culture and my heritage. Now let's dive into the collection. So you guys are the first to see this PR box. I kind of feel like it's tradition. I've been holding off sharing it on Instagram and stories. I teased it a little bit and so many of you guys were so mad because you guys were like, what the hell, why are you teasing us? But I feel like it's tradition that I kind of save this moment for all of you. So this is the box right here. I'm absolutely obsessed with how it turned out. Of course, we did a little soft touch moment. It says Caliente in the front. And of course, it has the Artist Tour logo in a gold hot stamp. Now, when you guys open the box, I really wanted to kind of, again, have that concept that I had for the music video shine through and really kind of tell that story with this box as well. See, right over here, we have our red vibe. It's kind of giving you a little like Latin poppy vibes. And then on this side, we have our little reggaeton star in the Lambo. And then you guys open it up on this side and it reveals the entire collection. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys everything that is in this box, break it down for you guys. And I'm super excited because for the first time ever, the PR box will be available for sale. I know there's so many of you guys that really, really wanted to get your hands on the Supreme Nudes box. And I just really wanted to make sure that for all of you guys that wanted this box, we would have it available. We do have very limited quantities. I'm super excited that for the first time ever, we're making these PR boxes available to you guys at home. So when you guys get the palette, it's gonna look like this. It comes in this red unicarton. She's like a really nice, like satiny finish. Of course, it says Scaliente in the front. It has our logo, again, in that classic, like artist couture gold. In the back, it is gonna have all of the ingredients. Again, just a reminder, we are vegan and cruelty free. This palette is technically considered a pressed pigment palette because of the ingredients that are used to create some of the shades. So I'm gonna go ahead and open it for you guys so you guys can see what it looks like. I really had this vision for like this sunset, kind of like candy paint moment. So I wanted to do something with a little bit more color and this is what we came up with. And I am honestly so happy with how it looks. It has a beautiful ombre over spray again in the front it says caliente it has the artist couture logo right there and it's just so compact so sleek so clean so sexy if you guys are familiar with my supreme nudes palette it is super sleek super clean and i wanted to do the exact same thing for this so this is actually tooled and molded to be like almost like a supreme nudes of like if that component was zapped into a little like mini size palette that is exactly what this is when you guys open it up it is a magnet closure so just like supreme nudes you do have the two magnets at the top so she just stays really nice and secure this mirror is really really nice and big i love the size of this mirror but we actually did our logo inside of the mirror in this beautiful red tone i just thought it'd be like a really nice touch to just kind of go with the collection and just kind of add a little something different with this palette itself so i love this little tiny detail and i hope that you guys like it too I really wanted to make it a point to have all of the names in this palette be in Spanish. Again, I just kind of felt like this was kind of a way for me to just pay homage to my heritage and my culture. Every single word in this palette and every single color in this palette is so special. and reminds me of just kind of like my life and my upbringing and just like different moments in time that have really just shaped and molded me to be the person that I am today. So I'm super excited to dive in and share them with you guys. So we're gonna go ahead and start off with the yellow shade in the palette. This shade is called Cultura, which is basically culture in Spanish. I'm gonna read you guys the definition of what the color yellow means. So this is from Google. She says that the color yellow is the most luminous of all of the colors in the spectrum. It's the color of happiness, optimism, of enlightened creativity, sunshine, and spring. So whenever I think of my culture and whenever I think of like the Latin culture in general, I always think of just exactly that, just like happiness and optimism and just like so much fun and just brightness. So I thought yellow was the perfect shade to represent my culture. It's such a beautiful shade. It is nice and bold, but what I really love about it is you can really soften it up with a nice fluffy brush, or you can build it and layer it on and really build that pigment. To me, it's such a unique yellow because it's not too bright, it's not too dull, it doesn't pull too mustard. It's honestly like the perfect yellow tone. You guys can see she looks like this, so vibrant. 
and we're just gonna go ahead and do a little swatch on the back of my hand and you guys can see she's super buttery super pigmented again this is just one swatch I'm gonna go ahead and layer it so you guys can just kind of see the way that you guys can kick it up just adding a second layer right in there and you guys can see she is so beautiful but again so wearable at the same time so moving on to the next shade we have this incredible orange right in here this shade is called fuego which is a fire in spanish you guys might know that and this shade is actually like really really bright and vivid it's almost slightly like low-key a little neon i absolutely love it i honestly think it's such a unique shade i haven't really seen anything like this out there so i'm gonna go ahead and swatch this on the back of my hand for you guys so here we go. Again, this is Miss Fuego. Woo! You guys can see it is so bright, so pigmented, so vivid. And again, that is just one swatch, you guys. I'm gonna go ahead and add a second layer so you guys can see the way that you guys can just really kick it up and just really kind of like take it to the next level. Also, just a little tip, I absolutely love using this color as a blush. I actually have it on right now, especially if you're like a medium to deeper complexion. This looks incredible, especially if you love like an orangey, corally kind of tone on your cheeks. Just be mindful, it is a pressed pigment, so a little bit goes a long way. I would definitely use something a little bit more fluffy to make sure that it's like nice and blended. I would kind of start off a little bit lighter and just kind of build up as you would like again it is on my cheeks right now and I think it looks so beautiful the next shade in this palette is called vibras because you guys know it's all about the vibes this summer this is like a really beautiful pinky tone I think it is so appropriate for the season and it just gives this palette a lot of range again this tone as well you can also use it as like a blush again just be mindful it is a pressed pigment they're so buttery. If you guys are familiar with like Midnight Maven or Supreme Nudes, it is the same beautiful buttery formula. So it's just gonna be really, really easy to work with. It's gonna blend like a dream. Again, a little goes a long way. We're gonna go ahead and give it a swatch on the back of my hand. And this is Vibras. You guys can see full opaque color, incredible pigment. I'm gonna go ahead and add a second layer so you guys can see the way that it kicks it up the more that you layer it. I also really like to use this with my fingers as well. So if you're using this like in your crease and you really wanna build that pigment on your eyes, you can do that with like a flat, stiff brush or you can just kinda of pick it up on your finger and just kinda of like tap it into place. The next shade in the palette is this right up here. This one is called Mangorita. You guys know I am no stranger to a cocktail moment so I really wanted to kinda of have that in this palette. It is a beautiful, like a golden orange tone this is a metallic shade and when I tell you guys it is so buttery so creamy I'm gonna go ahead and swatch it for you guys so you guys can see how incredible it is we're gonna do a little live moment right on the back of my hand and you guys can see full pigment you guys can see the way that it just catches it in the light this color is so stunning I honestly feel like it's so unique because it's gold it's orange, it's kind of like a hybrid of both. I honestly think it's just so different. I really, really love the way that this shade turned out. So the next shade in the palette is this one right over here. This is called Rumba. So for all of you guys that know that I'm a little party animal, I love to turn up. For all of you guys that have been to Club Daddy, it's always a Rumba, so I had to make sure that we paid homage to that moment in this palette. Now when I tell you guys this shade is absolutely incredible, it's actually the shade that I have on my eyelids right now. I'm gonna go ahead and swatch it for you guys. Again, this is like an orange tone. It has a little bit of gold in it, but in my mind, it is so unique, it is so different. I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys a little bit of a swatch. And you guys can see, again, like that one and done moment, super high shine, just so buttery, so creamy, and it just gets the job done. So the next shade in the palette is this right here. This is called Brio. So growing up, my mom always encouraged me to just really be my authentic self. And now that I'm older, I'm all about just like really letting my true colors shine and not letting anything or anyone dim my shine. I really wanted to have that message in this palette. And this shade right in here, it's actually a multi-dimensional high pearl finish. So out of all of the shades, this is the one that's gonna pack the biggest punch as far as like the pearl content in the actual shade. It's like a beautiful, like a corally, opalescent pink. It's honestly so unique and so different. I'm absolutely obsessed with it. I actually also have it on, on top of that color fuego that I have on my cheeks as a little bit of a blush. You guys can kind of see, it'll kind of catch like a little bit of a pink tone. And I'm gonna go ahead and swatch this for you guys. Honestly, like I can tell you guys right now, like the camera does not do this shape any justice. It looks so fire. 
I'm gonna go ahead and swatch this on my hand. And you guys can see she's just like super high shine, super metallic. I'm gonna go ahead and layer on another little swatch for you guys. And you guys can see she is just kind of like a nice shift. She just really catches the light, which is why I really wanted to name this shade Brio to encourage all of you guys to shine at home. The next shade in the palette is actually the one that I feel probably took the longest to create, but I'm so happy with how it turned out. And it's the shade right in here, Miss Mamacita. And this is a pressed pigment, so a little bit does go a long way. I'm just gonna dip in here. It just feels so smooth and creamy. And I'm gonna give it a swatch on the back of my hand. And you guys can see she's super pigmented, super opaque. I'm gonna go ahead and add another layer. And what I really love about this shade, I honestly feel like red shades are so hard to nail. Again, like this was the one that really kind of gave me a hard time when creating the shade. But what I love about it is you can really, really blend it out and it's not gonna like get a little blotchy or kind of like spotty or muddy. But trust me, this shade blends out absolutely beautifully. It is just a dream to work with and I'm so happy with how it turned out. We couldn't have a Caliente palette without a red, so I'm really happy with Mamacita. And the last shade in the palette is Sensual, and that means sensual in Spanish. I've always felt like the Latin culture is very sensual, very sexual, even when it comes to like the actual language itself and music. I've just always been so drawn to how things sound in Spanish. I just think things just sound so much more romantic, so much more sexy and sensual. So I really kind of wanted to tell that story with this shade. This is a beautiful, rich terracotta moment, and honestly, this shade plays so well with every single color in the palette. I have this color right in here to kind of deepen up my outer corner with this eye look, and I also have it underneath my lash line. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what it looks like live in the flesh. She is, again, right over here. Now, although this is a terracotta, it does kind of have a little bit more of like a bricky, orangey vibe. I felt like it made it really, really unique as opposed to your traditional terracotta tones. So I'm really, really obsessed with how this shade turned out. And you guys can see it is super rich. I don't know if the camera's picking it up, but you guys can kind of see again, like it has more like that bricky, orangey tone. I'm gonna go ahead and give it another little swatch on top so you guys can see what it looks like when you layer it. Honestly, whenever you need something to just add some depth and definition to any look, this is definitely your girl. I honestly can't express to you guys how hard it is to create an eyeshadow palette and only have to pick eight shades. I think we created like a total of like 12 or 15 shades and these are the ones that actually made the final cut. And when it comes to creating these color stories, I make it a point to make sure that we test them, that we make sure that everything just like plays and goes hand in hand with each other. So every single shade in this palette is meant to work with each other. So it's really, really easy to use. And even if you guys are looking at the palette, you guys can see that like, we almost kind of like created little looks for you guys when it comes to the rose. But honestly, all of these shades play so well with each other. So I highly encourage you guys to just get creative. Really hope you guys feel like you guys can bring summer into your homes with this palette. So I just really, really hope that this inspires you guys to just step outside of the box and add a little color to your life. So this palette is gonna retail for $30. You guys already know how I am when it comes to my brand. We're all about accessible luxury. So a super accessible price point in my opinion. And you guys are getting a beautiful luxe component. It just feels really, really special and unique. The ingredients and the formulas are so beautiful, super high quality, high performance, and I really, really honestly think you guys are gonna be so happy when you guys get this palette. Okay, so now that we got my amazing, gorgeous palette out of the way, let's get into our brand new Silk Cream Lipstick. I'm so excited that you guys have been loving the Silk Cream Lipstick formula. We launched them and introduced them with our Supreme Nudes collection. I'm honestly so obsessed with the formula and I'm so glad that you guys are as well. And I was super excited to bring some color into the world specifically with this formula. So some of you guys may or may not know, but one of the reasons that I really got into beauty is because I was always around beauty because of my mom. I grew up with like my my aunts and my cousins and I just remember my mom would always take me with her shopping at like department stores and the one thing that I could always count on is her rocking a red lip. I have like super vivid memories of us going to like department stores. She'd pick up her skincare, she'd pick up her fragrance and she would always pick up a red lip. So I really wanted to create something that was like a modern take on what that red lip would be and we created the shade Caliente. 
So this lipstick does come in our traditional silk cream lipstick unicarton. Again, a nice black satin finish, and it's gonna have a shade seal at the top that says Caliente. Now we're gonna go ahead and open it so you guys can see what it looks like. The component is exactly like the rest of our silk cream lipstick, so it creates a beautiful family. I'm gonna go ahead and open it up and show you guys how stunning this red lip is. So I'm gonna go ahead and twist it up so you guys can see, and in my opinion, this is literally like the perfect fiery red. Again, same beautiful creamy formula, glides on really easily. One swipe, you get that full opaque color. I'm gonna go ahead and swatch it on the back of my hand for you guys, and I'm gonna actually apply it for you guys so you guys can see what it looks like. But again, it is super rich and creamy. We're just gonna go ahead and do a little like swatchy moment right in here, just like so. And you guys can see the tone is so beautiful, it's so rich. This honestly is the perfect red lip to pair with any look that you create with the actual palette itself. You guys can see it is just so rich in tone. I absolutely love it. I'm so happy with how this red lipstick turned out. So I went ahead and I removed the lip that I was wearing so I can show you guys what this looks like. You guys know I'm all about nudes, but honestly, like this red makes me feel like so fire. Like I just feel like that bitch when I'm wearing this lipstick. Again, super, super creamy. It literally glides on like butter. I low key love butter, so I love this lipstick. We're just gonna go ahead and start here and just glide on. And you guys can see like full color payoff. Okay, so. You guys can see this color looks so beautiful. I love how it contrasts with like my eye look because I feel like I'm giving you like sunset vibes on the eyes and then I'm just hitting you like bam with the red lip. It's just giving you that like sexy, fiery, caliente vibe and I just think it is so perfect. This lipstick will retail for $18 just like the rest of the Silk Cream lipsticks. Again, she is vegan, she is cruelty free and I think it's the perfect lip color to complement the palette. So make sure you guys definitely pick this baby up because this is limited edition and trust me when I say it is the absolute perfect fiery red. And last but not least in this collection where we're introducing two of my Diamond Lip Tease glosses. So I'm very much a, if it's not broken, don't fix it type of person. When I was creating looks for this collection and going through the color story, I knew that I wanted to create like a beautiful tangerine lip gloss as well as something a little bit more mauve and more wearable. And I just kind of started to think like, we kind of already did that with our Diamond Lip Tease glosses. So I felt like it would be the perfect opportunity to reintroduce them to you guys. Both of these glosses are vegan, cruelty free. They're infused with hemp seed oil, so it's super, super moisturizing on the lips. Super, super high shine. They are infused with finely milled pearls, so you're not gonna get like that gritty feeling at all. But if you're someone that loves a super high shine, glossy lip, this is definitely gonna be your best friend. I'm gonna go ahead and apply the first shade. This is Peep Show. Again, she's like a beautiful tangerine moment. This is actually the gloss that I was wearing um, earlier in the video. I paired it on top of Boy Toy Lipstick. With these, a little goes a long way. Trust me when I say all you need is one swipe. So I'm just gonna go ahead and add this right in here. And you guys can see because of the pearl, she kind of starts to give you more of like a pinky vibe moment. This is almost like if Brio had a cousin that was a gloss, that would be her, that would be Miss Peep Show. And I just love that the wand is so flexible. Again, it's a beautiful teardrop applicator, so you get really nice, precise application when it comes to this gloss. And last but not least, we have Miss La Freak Diamond Lip Tease. So this gloss is a little bit more of a mauve base, and what I mean by that, it's not gonna be like super opaque in color, but you can definitely see like that tone. And this does have beautiful like gold and like magenta pearls. So it just really looks beautiful the way that they both contrast. And again, I'm just applying it like right in the center to just give my lips a really beautiful, like nice pout and shine. And you guys can see this is definitely probably the closest thing to my lips. So I really wanted to make sure that I had something that was a little bit more wearable in case you are creating a bolder look with the palette and have a lip product that complements the look without it kind of competing with one or the other. So you can really kind of make that decision whether you want your eyes to be the focus of the makeup or if you want your lips to kind of do more of the talking. All right, guys, that is it. That is my entire Caliente Summer Collection. I hope you guys love it just as much as I do. We worked so hard to make it happen. And to be really honest with you guys, it almost didn't happen, 
but we really pushed through. We have some incredible partners, have an incredible team, and we made it happen. And I'm so glad that it is finally here. This collection is available right now on artistcouture.com, as well as this PR box. Again, super, super limited quantities of this PR box. So if you guys wanna get your hands on it, make sure you guys head over to the website right now. And this entire collection will also be available on Sephora.com on Tuesday, July 28th. Whew. Before you guys go, make sure you guys subscribe to my channel. Don't be shady, be a lady. Hit that subscribe button and make sure you guys turn on the notification bell so you guys don't miss any of my videos. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys are the most excited about for this collection. What eyeshadow shade is your favorite, how you guys are feeling about the names, what lip product you're excited to use, and also let me know what kind of looks you guys wanna see me create. I definitely am gonna be creating tons of tutorials showing you guys exactly how to wear this palette. So let me know in the comments what you guys would like to see. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Thank you guys so much for all of your love and support and just for being so incredible and just really being a part of this journey with my brand. I'm so happy with everything and I hope you guys love it. And I cannot wait to see you guys rocking some Caliente looks. I will see you guys in my next video. I love you guys so much. Mwah. Bye guys.